Sherelle Starr and I'm going to share with you some simple bridal shower games. The first game that I want to share with you gets used a lot, but it gets used a lot actually at baby showers and what we want to do is remix it for a bridal shower. The first game I'm going to share with you is called Don't Speak and you know, basically all you need is a clothespin line, a couple of wedding rings that you can get from any craft store, these are not real, it'd be bad luck, um, but these are fake plastic ones and you take two rings, you put them on a clothespin and you give these to your guests as they enter and you give them a keyword that they can't say. Um, either bride or wedding or marriage, anything in that vein. And as they're going around introducing themselves, talking about how they met you know, the bride-to-be, if they say the taboo word, they lose one of their rings. And the goal of the game is to be the person at the end of the shower with the most rings. And that person gets a prize. You can either use a favor or a pretty plant. Um, any prize will do, but that that helps a large crowd actually in, engage and actually speak to each other. And you know, they're trying to win a prize at the end, so it really helps open up the crowd. The second game I'm going to share with you is How Well Do You Know? And this is a very, very simple game. Um, if you are the maid of honor or one of the bridesmaids, maid, it really shouldn't take very long to put together a list. But essentially what you're doing is put to, putting together a list of questions that guests can ask each other about the bride or about the couple. And qu uh, questions that revolve around, you know, where maybe they met, what's the date of their wedding, where they're going on honeymoon, any sort of questions. It can even be questions from when the bride was younger, what was her favorite school, what was the name of her favorite pet. So any questions along those lines, but it's really to help be an icebreaker for a large crowd or a large group, and it gets people engaging as they're walking around asking these questions to each other. Uh, you can give a prize at the end, or you can just sort of announce the answers at the end and then move on to a different part of the event. The last game that I really want to share with you for bridal showers that I really love is called Secret Message. And it really is bridal shower, bride groom specific. What you do is you give guests a piece of paper, it can be any piece of paper, colored paper, craft paper, really doesn't matter. But you give them a piece of paper when they walk in and you tell them that they need to write a message to the bride that she is to open on a specific date. Um, and so it could be on her honeymoon night. It could be on the day she arrives back from her honeymoon. It could be on their one year anniversary or their 10 year anniversary. But you write them, but the goal is for them to write a message for the bride to open on that specific day. You take the messages back and you seal them. So you're not gonna open them. But what you're gonna do is actually have the guests write the day that they can, that the bride can open them on the top of the envelope. So let's say, you know, 4th of July. And she cannot open this message until that day. And what we really hope is that, you know, the guests put something really inspirational or a tip that they've learned from their marriage, something that she can take and use to make sure her marriage is strong and long lasting. And this is a really fun, a fun game because you can actually once you've got all the messages, you can take them all and make a little list on the wall of the dates that really seem to be popping out in the group. So sometimes their first anniversary, sometimes their 10th anniversary, and really just sort of see where people are focused and sort of start conversations on why that might be. You know, why is the you know 10th year of marriage a point where you might need a lot of inspiration? And it's just a fun way to get the crowd talking. So this is a really fun game and really easy to activate within your event. I'm Sherelle Starr and I just shared with you three games that you can use for bridal showers. <music>